Hey YouTube, it's Charisma. I am back. Um, like I told you yesterday, I washed and deep conditioned my hair and began doing the two strand flat twist. And um, I wanted to let the back air dry, which I did. I had it in big braids and I let it air dry and it's dry now. And I just took out the braids and it's sort of crinkly. And I'm going to begin twisting the back. So I just wanted to keep you posted. Um, from time to time, I'll just show you where I'm at in the process, but I wanted to show you, I wanted to show you my hair and I'll be using extra virgin raw coconut oil to put in my twist. Okay, so I will keep you posted. I am in the Bye. process of doing my twist. See? And, um, as promised, I, I said that I would show you how I did one or two of them. So I'm going to show you like one or two, and then I'm going to get back to twisting. I'm going to get down on my knees because I don't have a chair. I usually braid with, um, I usually braid in front of the mirror standing up. I don't know why. So I have my coconut oil. I'm also using the black Jamaican castor oil um, for my scalp. It's mixed with a couple of other oils that I like, but I'm currently using that on my scalp because like I told you, I have thinning on this side here. You could probably tell because you see more scalp here on the right side, but it'll get better. And um, yeah, so, okay. So what I'm doing, um, there's a different way that you can also do the twist. Um, I'm doing it where I'm going to start a braid at the beginning and then twist the rest of the way down. Um, that's really just to keep it a little tighter. I don't know. I think I like it better that way. The last time I did it in the pictures where I did the video with the hairstyles, it wasn't braided at the beginning, it was just twisted, but those were just like big twists on the go and then I pinned pin them up. But I want these to last a little bit longer. Um, I'm gonna say a week. I'm gonna, I'm gonna aim for two weeks, but we'll see. As soon as braids and twists start getting messy and looking raggedy, I can't walk around like that. So I just put a little coconut oil in there. And this one feels smooth. Okay, so I start with a braid and I don't braid all the way down. I just start it off. Yeah, it is just to keep it a little bit tighter. I feel more secure that way. And then just twist it the rest of the way down like this. Just like that. Okay, YouTube, here's another section. Put a little coconut oil. When I parted this way, I had put the uh, Jamaican black castor oil in it. And so as I'm grabbing each piece, I'm just putting a little coconut oil on the end and stuff. Okay, so I start out with a braid. Put my head down so you can see. And then twist the rest of the way down. Now sometimes this will create like a little waviness in the um, twist. It could be a good thing. I think it looks cute. Some people might not like that. They want their twist to just be straight down. And that's cool. Doesn't matter to me. As long as it looks cute. There you go. One more. And I didn't um, blow dry my hair. I just made big braids in the back, let it air dry, washed yesterday. And um, I like it this way because it has texture to it. I don't want it to be too straight when I'm braiding or twisting.
And that's it. So I did about three for you guys. I hope you like it and I will be coming back with the finished product. I think my hair is growing some. I just cut an inch off two weeks ago but that's okay because I noticed that when I do my braids they are fat from the root all the way down to the end so I like that. That means I'd rather have a short fat braid than a short thin braid because then that means you have short and thin hair but I want thick hair so if it's short and thick it's fine because it's gonna grow and I want it to be long and thick so I'll be back <laughs> that don't sound so right I'll be back <laughs> and show you the finished product this is the okay. finished product I'm finally done twisting my hair and I like it I am going to try to keep this style in for two weeks and I hope it lasts and um, I have school this week, so I don't have to worry about my hair in the morning. I'm really, really happy with it. Here's the back, if you can see. And this is the front. So I did the two strand flat twists in the front and the twists in the back. They started out as braids by, at the roots, and then it's twists at, all the way to the bottom. So that's it. So now I see the difference between the twists and the braids. The twists actually look fluffier, they're more playful, as opposed to the braids, they're just straight down. And um, they're not as puffy, so it kind of like, almost kind of makes your hair kind of straight when you braid it, in a way, if you know what I'm saying. Even when you curl it up, because I noticed it, like, it felt thinner when it was braided, I guess, because it's tightly together, like, so, but the puff, the, not the puff, but the twists, they're like a little bit more puffy and playful so yeah I have more body to work with but I'm very very happy and um, I'll show you some pictures so keep watching please rate comment and subscribe let me know how you like it okay and I want to give a very big thanks to all my subscribers I finally made a hundred yay and I hope to make a hundred and yeah a hundred more <laughs> A whole lot more, but yeah. Okay, bye.